it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 5 of D4DJ First Mix. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, hello, puppy. <laughs> Mooney, what's wrong? Or is it more on your reviews on you guys separately? Oh, because you're not gonna get any praise? <laughs> Aww. Poor baby. <coughs> Cody! <laughs> Come here. Hello. Hold on, you're on my cord. You're on my cord. Alright, there you go. Hello, hello. I love you. Hello. Sit. So cute, baby. Poor Mooney. God, you are, you're freaking warm, little dog. Alright, can you go lay down on my bed, please? Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Hopefully, maybe Fontana Maiden will make an actual appearance instead of just like a poster background, <laughs> but probably not. I don't know. Wait, wait. There you go. Go play or go lay down. <laughs> well, Mooney, what do you what do you want? What do you want people to say? Cody, will you stop? I mean, because you can tell she wants the praise. Maybe. <laughs> A little bit. What's up? Well, Maho, yeah, you're right about that. Uh, <laughs> and they just happen to walk into each other, you know? Mm. 
Yeah, she's right. I mean, because, you know, that's the biggest thing that I'm kind of wondering later on when she... When she gets un, uh, other cards. Like, especially if they do an event with her. Because I didn't see the picture of her three star from that Lyrical Lily Happy Around event. Oh, damn! Fun. Yeah, the bunny ears that you ordered. <laughs> because you ordered it on her phone. Uh huh. <laughs> Rinku. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I kind of said Maho was very similar to like Adisa. I kind of changed my mind. Mooney is more Adisa. <laughs> Maho is like Ote Saya. Like that. <sighs> oh, really? <laughs> well, you got this. You you're probably good at singing. We just need to. Test it out, you know? Yeah, you know who else should sing? Ray should sing. I'm just saying, because you know who she's playing by? Like, mm, yeah. Maybe Mooney should write her own song. Why don't you all just sleep over? So precious. <laughs> yeah, this is for your chance for you to bond, be a little closer, have one more than one relationship than just Rinku. Be like, 
like Because we're making instant curry. Probably, but... Mm. No, Moni, you're kind of lying to yourself, babe. So cute. Wouldn't that be a little weird, though, to cram all of them? Mm. But it might be something awesome. It's pretty. Hmm. 
Mm-hmm. But it's you. <laughs> So then you just play a keyboard. 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 Yeah, so you find there's there's really no other excuse. You're doing it. Oh, yeah, she can do that. She just doesn't have to do the whole dance. She only does, like, certain ones. <laughs> yeah. Yes! Because <laughs> it wouldn't be fair if literally just like half of the girls. Oh god. <laughs> What's up, Shinobo? It's uh, really long. <gasps> oh my god! You look so cute! Finally, we get to see her outfit in 3D. Right, your wrinkle is showing a lot, and I love it. Okay, let's go ahead and talk about this real quick. So, since we are now finally going into the character songs for these four girls and Mooney is first, I'm really excited to hear Ray's because, of course, that's a wrinkle. Baby. And we already know she got a good vein and she got a good singing voice. Oh, come on. I just, I want to hear her. It's so bad. And then, plus, I want to see her, like, how Maho sounds and then... Well, we've heard Rinku, so just really Maho.
freaking adorable. Okay, yes, but let's just go ahead and change this name. This name is too long. <laughs> it's too long. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my god. Well, you already have your unit name. Ask Rinku. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Precious baby. Okay, I mean, for a first character song for Happy Ron, honestly, I loved it. This is good. Biggest thing that I'm kind of hoping, because they never did this with Vendor Name, and I pray to God they do this with this series because it would be really good. I I really want everyone from all the other units to also get their own char character songs. I mean, typically, like, going back to Bandity, because since I've been comparing the show to Bandity ever since, like, kind of day one, um, Popping Party was the only ones who got that character songs and stuff. And I love the fact that Mooney was the first one because I think Mooney, starting out with her, it's special because typically we start with the lead who is Rinku or Kasumi, or I would have assumed they would have possibly started with Maho first, but really I think hearing Maho and Ray next for their character songs will be really good. Don't know if they'll do it next week, but maybe like, Two episodes from now, so eight, maybe, possibly. I don't know. It was a good episode, but, um, oh, God, do I want to talk about this? <laughs> okay, well, I'll talk about it in a second. We're going to wait and see what the preview is going to show for next week, and then we'll talk about my little dislike of a problem. <laughs> she tried. Well, that's interesting. So that could be Fonton Maiden, and maybe that's how they're also going to get their first official appearance and introduction, because I don't count the ish that we got last week, because, I mean, you had one, maybe one character of Fonton Maiden speak, and then they had the music video of Way of Life. Okay, here's my little, my little two cent niche on this show for right now, and I mean, this is because... Of someone who also watched Bunsity season one first before the game came out. Okay. So going into this show and seeing the poster. I think it was like maybe um, the newer poster like a month or a week. A couple. No. It was at the beginning of October. At the beginning of October when they showed the poster of this for the anime. And showing. Ha uh, I'm about to do it again. <laughs> Wrong. Not Hello Happy World. Happy Around. Um. Peaky Peaky and Fontaine Maiden, my thing was going into this show that like these three groups were either going to get equal or at least um, Fontaine Maiden and Peaky Peaky would have gotten at least equal showing and then of course Happy Around would get the most because season one of this show, just like with Bendity, is going to be a very heavily Happy Around Focus, and I get that. I'm not wrong with that. But it seems like as of right now, going into five episodes into the show, it feels like Peaky Peaky 
is getting the bare minimum. I get the fact that Peaky Peaky is somewhat of the senpais of the group. And so with the first season, they're not going to be, they're going to be shown, but they're not going to get like very heavily, you know, um, developed. That's the same thing for freaking Fonson Maiden. If Fonson Maiden does make an, an actual appearance instead of just like a poster appearance like they did last week. Then you also had Rondo making like a second, just one little second appearance. And I was, yeah, I'm excited about that. But at the same time, I'm like, I do want to see them more. I feel like what they're possibly going to do with the last two groups, my personal fave group, Mermaid and Lyrical Lily, they're probably going to also put them in the background as well. So, I mean, as I told one of my friends, I'm like, yeah, kind of start paying more to the, ba- uh, pay attention more to the backgrounds because I feel like they're going to put up music videos of them. They haven't released a music video for Mermaid or Lilica Lily, just more of them doing like the 2D music video covers of Fujiyama Disco and um, the song for School Live. That's it. There really hasn't been a 3D-esque music video for them except Happy Around and... No, mm -mm, take Happy Around out. Peaky Peaky and Fontaine Maiden. They're the only two that have 3D performances. Everybody else has had 2D. So hopefully we do... Because they were... They even said that they were supposed to get 3... Everybody's supposed to get 3D music videos. I want to see it. (laughs) I'm just saying, but it was a really good episode. Honestly, I can't wait until next week. Next week looks like it's going to be, you know, scary, um, funny, and honestly, I love that. It's going to be really, really good. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode five of D4DJ First Mix. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for episode six. Bye, guys.